I'm a big fan of AI agents and I've tried lots of them, but this one claims to be one of the most intelligent out there right now. It's called Flow With and we're going to try it out in this video. Now, this AI agent is capable of creating web pages, presentations, videos, images. It's truly multimodal. It can create books, like an entire book, because it has such a huge context window. And you can also upload your own knowledge to your AI agent to make it trained in exactly the subject that you want to, maybe some business documents or something like that. They also have their own dedicated iOS app as well, so you can run it on your phone. So this AI agent is going to be super useful if you're a digital professional, you're a knowledge worker, you know, teachers and students, researchers, people like that, and then also designers, writers, entertainment enthusiasts, developers and AI tech people, startup founders and collaborative teams. So there's a lot of people that this AI agent can help. But we are going to use it to create a full website complete with images and videos and research the whole lot. We're going to get it to do it for us because it doesn't just follow commands. It basically creates an entire strategy, adjusts that strategy, speaks to you to find out what it is that you would like for clarification and then gets on with the job. And if you want to try this software out, there's a link underneath this video and some invite codes. Just go to the site and then just click try flow now and then you're in. So first of all, once you're logged in, this is what you're going to see here. Very familiar. You've got your prompt area just here. We can actually choose from a whole load of different LLMs, all the best ones like uh, GPT 4.1 and DeepSeek, Gemini, uh, Claude, Anthropics, Claude uh, 4, Opus even. So all of the best ones right there. And then just down the bottom here, we can choose online search, image video, prompt enhance, uh, comparison and agent mode. Now, agent mode is what we're interested in. So we'll switch it on. And now you can see it can do a whole load of other things like uh, searching Twitter, using a browser, searching images, uh, watching videos. It can watch videos for you. That's crazy. And then uh, read a knowledge base. And the knowledge base is I told you that you can add your own documents. You do that just up here in the knowledge garden on the left hand side like so. And you can just literally start adding things into this knowledge base for your AI agent to use. But we don't need any for this particular task that I'm going to give it because I am going to put in this big prompt right here. There we go. And I'm just going to tell you what it says roughly. Please create a website designed for the general public as a one stop destination to learn about Bitcoin. The site should be beginner friendly, engaging and easy to navigate and so on. I've said I want it gold, black and white colors. And then this is kind of all the content that I would like on there. I want to have real time uh, pricing for Bitcoin to come into my website. Glossary of terms, FAQ, kind of like a Bitcoin for dummies style website. And obviously it's got to do an awful lot of research for that as well. We want e email capture too. So uh, a form for visitors to sign up for updates. Uh, so it's got a lot going on there, but can it cope? Can it do it? Well, let's just see and press the magic start button. So it's created a canvas straight away and you can left click and drag the canvas around so you can see everything that's going on on the canvas. And then it will also ask follow up questions as well. Like I said, if it's unsure about anything and then you can also add new branches to your canvas as well. But we'll go through that as we go along and then also selecting a mode. So any particular area on the canvas, you can then sort of switch models. You can do all kinds of different things. So here's our canvas. As I say, we can shrink it down like this. There is the initial prompt just here. And it's now getting to work and uh, starting to build our website. So we'll leave that running. There it is. Look at that. So now it's got all of these new, what, what I imagine to be kind of pages here of the website, but we will see what it, what it does. So let's take a quick look at what it's done so far, because we can zoom in. There we go. So it's got a summary um, of a comprehensive beginner guide to Bitcoin. Then we'll just move along here. What we got? Bitcoin is a decentralized digital currency just there. And then it's talking about the uh, the actual history of the Bitcoin and everything. So this looks like it's going to be a really good website for someone who really doesn't know much about Bitcoin. But it's now moving on to the next part of its job. Look at this. 
So after five minutes or so, we have got to this point. The entire website has been done for us. It's created these high quality graphics, as you can see right here. Let me zoom in on one. And then we've got our website just here like that. And it says to us just there in the bottom card, I've created the initial version of your Bitcoin educational website, which includes the main content. Uh, content sections, visual assets, live price feed, and an email capture form. Uh, if you're happy, then it will proceed to create the short animated explainer videos. So that's really cool. Well, let's go and look at the website because that's the most important thing. Here it is. Um, wow, look at that. It's followed my guidelines in terms of color scheme and everything. Nice big heading up there, your first step into digital money. A clear, simple and friendly guide to understanding Bitcoin. No jargon, no complexity, just the essentials you need to get started. Love it. There's the live prices. And then we've got some text there um, all about what is Bitcoin, the origin of Bitcoin, as it describes there. It's pretty mysterious. There's our images that we uh, created. And then underneath, key factors, common market misconceptions, and then a whole glossary of terms and an FAQ as well with these little dynamic drop downs here like that. And there finally at the bottom is our little subscription area too. So it has followed the instructions really well and the navigation up the top here works perfectly. But now let's see if it can really up its game and start creating some multimedia content to go into this website. So what it's doing now then is actually creating a storyboard of little short videos, explainer videos for each thing here. Look at this. What is Bitcoin? How the blockchain works? What is mining? What are digital wallets? And then it's going on to the next phase like that. So this is going to be fascinating to see how well it manages to explain the whole concept of Bitcoin to us. So now it's created these little videos just here. There you go. You can see them. Look at this. Let me just zoom in. That looks really cool. And then we've got like what is mining just there. And then just down the bottom now, it's gone and added them to the website just here. We can open that up in a new tab now. There we go. There's our updated site. We've got our live prices that we saw earlier and then our videos just there. So this is a really, really powerful AI agent, as you can see. Now, obviously, editing your website is something that you might want to do as well. So what you can do is just click on this um, little icon here and it says edit in full screen. And then it's just going to bring it up like this. And anybody can use this software to edit. So you just click selection tool. And now we can scroll down and let's just say that maybe we weren't that happy with this title. We can click on it right there and then go ahead and add anything we want. So your first step into digital money for let's just put for beginners. There we go. Let's get, actually spell it right as well. And then we can change the font style as well if we want, like bold, italic. There you go. Look at that. And then um, put it back to bold. It's very, very easy to just go and edit the website just with no kind of coding skills or anything. If you want to undo or redo anything, we've got these controls down the bottom. And then once you're happy, you just click save and then that's it. Now your website is, is edited. So it's a very, very powerful, uh, simple to use agent that it really does represent what you can do now with no code or, or technical knowledge. So I have incidentally, I've never used the software before I actually made this video. I just went straight in as if I was a brand new user like yourself and then was able to create that full website and live update of Bitcoin pricing. So this is flow with. You need to try it out. Use those invite codes before they all go. There's a link underneath this video. I really hope you liked it. If you did, press the like button and I'll see you in another AI related video very, very soon.